so proud of the work of Chairman Adam Schiff. So what is the president afraid of? Is he afraid of the truth, that he would go after a member, a chairman of a committee, a respected chairman of a committee in the Congress? I think they're just scaredy cats. Well, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi rushing to Adam Schiff's defense while also taking a jab at House Republicans who are calling for Mr. Schiff's resignation. Here to react is House Minority Whip and Republican Congressman of the great state of Louisiana, Steve Scalise, who apparently is one of the scaredy cats. <laughs> good morning. Good to be with you. Good morning. And not so much on that. I think a lot of Pelosi's poodles out there running scared of, uh, of the facts, but they're still trying to chase down witch hunts. If that's what they want to be, the party uh, of just constant harassment of the president, of his family, uh, of allowing babies who are born to be killed when they're outside of the womb, that's what they become. That's uh, it's radical. What do you make of the House uh, Intel Committee Republicans who yesterday called on Adam Schiff, who is the chairman? Hey, you have uh, deceived the American public long enough, and there they are right there. You need to resign. Yeah, it was powerful words, and frankly, it's rooted in the fact that for the last two years, Adam Schiff's been going around saying he's got more than circumstantial evidence of collusion. And they've been hanging their hat on the Mueller report. They right. were convinced there'd be indictments and there'd be all this evidence of collusion, and there was none. In fact, he said there's going to be no new indictments and there was no collusion, and they still won't get over it. They want to double down. And, and look, if he's got some secret evidence right. that he's hiding from the prosecutors, this is lunacy. Uh, th there was no collusion. Get over that fact. Nobody should have wanted it to happen anyway, but it didn't happen. And yet for two years they've been peddling this lie. Well, and now it seems the narrative has shifted into uh, the attorney general is uh, concealing damaging information, stuff that was that is in the Mueller report. So when the Mueller report comes out and it confirms that there was no collusion and still says no indictments, are they going to then give it up? No, they will never admit they were wrong. They just move on and make some other baseless accusation. Remember the history. These are the people that said, if you like what you have, you can keep it. Right. Millions of people lost their good health care. They said there was collusion. There was more than strong evidence collusion. There was no collusion. Whatever they're going to say next, just consider the source. All right. Uh, your next piece of legislation on Tuesday, you're going to introduce the Born Alive Act. That would do what? So Ann Wagner from Missouri filed this bill called the Born Alive Act. And what it does is it gives full legal protections to babies who are born outside the womb. When I talk to people all around the country, the first thing they say is, why would you need to do that? It, it already right. exists, right? It doesn't. Look at New York. New York celebrated the fact that if a baby is born alive, they can still kill it and call it abortion. In Virginia, you saw the governor explaining mm -hmm. barbarically how you can still kill the baby after it's born outside the womb. Steve, we're not even talking about the abortion debate anymore. This is murder. We need to protect innocent life. When, you, when the baby is born alive outside the womb, it should be fully protected. Starting Tuesday, we right. will be collecting signatures on a discharge petition to get this bill brought to the floor for a vote. I think a more majority of Americans would support something like that. A majority of people who are pro-choice support this bill. They think this is mm -hmm. beyond the abortion debate. Okay. You're murdering an innocent life. Let's protect those babies who are born outside the womb. All right. Steve Scalise. Great being with you. Go Thank Tigers. You. Indeed. There you go.